everyone and welcome back to my channel and thank you all for being here I appreciate each and every one of you and thank you to all my new subscribers I'm so excited to have you here and welcome to the frugal and fabulous family so today is day five of my no spend month challenge and I have not spent any money so far this month today has been going really well i'm just in the process of taking everything out of my garden and my mom came in for a visit because she works out here once a week and um yeah so first i wanted to share with you for halloween I, we have a box of costumes that I have saved certain things over the years. I'm just going to show you some of them. I got this little dress a while ago. It was actually a dress, but it makes for a really nice costume. It's nice and shiny. And then to go with that, I, I've had this big wig. It's like a fro. And if you put that and that together, it's a really good kind of disco -y outfit. Or I can use that with this. I got this, um, it's called a flacker costume. So you just put it on your head. It looks really good. I was that one year. And I even got the, the stick that you can put this, a fake cigarette in the end. So I have that as well. A lot of the stuff we just can mix and match and do whatever we want. And I bought this hat one year for my daughter. She wanted to be a witch. It's quite a cute little hat. And then of course, no Halloween costume is complete without a kitty cat costume. So we got the ears and the tail. And then, oh! Look at that. We got some cheerleading pom-poms. And we even have a cheerleader's outfit to go with that. That is more for my daughter, but yeah, it's really cute. And it comes with a little skirt as well. And then we also have, I've got my little devil ears and these white cuffs for your arms and I just wear something red when I do that and then I got my maid outfit here black and yeah it's a really cute outfit as well it comes with the apron and it comes with the dress and then it also comes with um there's a little piece for my for the head oh yeah here it is this little piece if you can see and just wrap it on your head and then of course to go with my flapper costume I got my black long gloves and then I have some random things to put these on they're like this kind of cool and they're fish netted and then I also have a Dorothy costume too and it came with the stockings and then I actually have some red sparkly shoes to go along with it and I'm not going to take those out so I have that as well and then this I got for free it's just like a I thought it was a retro type shirt and they actually gave it to me for like just to wear but I thought I'm never gonna wear this, so I kept it just in case I ever wanted to do. I could wear it with my faux hair as a disco outfit too. And then we have, uh, let's see, where's this? this is a beautiful feathery thing. And then we have a Santa Claus hat. I don't know what that's doing in there, but for, you know, of course we have a tiara to go along with my boa then we have our halloween bag in here and then another apron 
for whatever we want to use it for. Can't remember where we got this, but this was given to us as well. A lot of this stuff was free and or very old. And then this was my daughter's outfit years ago. It's like a witch's or type thing. And then we have another, this princess hat. We got this from Disney World. And this goes on. And then we have a little wand, and now it's complete. <laughs> and then also we have this mask put on if you don't really want to dress up too much. And then I also have this tiny little mini baker outfit. It comes with a little hat. And then, oops, this little apron. It's so cute. Oh, and there's no... Nothing quite complete without a disco glasses. <laughs> and, well, you know, I got some beads and some shell necklace in here. And then we have some Minnie Mouse ears. And we got a bunch of lay, I think these are called lays. Or whatever. These were from my mom's 60th birthday. We threw a Hawaiian themed birthday party for her and so we kept these. There's beads and a little skirt. So yeah, all of this we've had for quite some time and that's all we have. We're, and we just go in here, choose something. My daughter might want to be something different this year, but that's okay. We're not won't be buying anything. But I did put the word out. She wants to be a veterinarian, so I'm gonna see if we can find some stuff that we can put together for that. Anyways, I just wanted to put show you guys because I do believe Susan asked me if we had Halloween here. I just wanted to show that yes we do and it is so much fun to dress up and we love dressing up for the occasion because sometimes it's just fun to be someone else for a day and I'm just going to throw that stuff in here quickly so I wanted to show you also our free decor that we made and that I set up. So on this table, you can see, I put, I set up these little pumpkins and ignore the monkey man, he's just my cameraman. And then we have these pine cones in a basket here. And then if we come over here, this we, I just put a little fall slash Halloween display. I got these candles from my Oma and they're cathedral candles and then my husband had these skull uh, tea light holders for years, but I, I don't really like them. But I took them out because of Halloween. Other than that, I, I would not want them for decoration. But because it's Halloween, we had them out. And this is just like a free squash. And these are my spaghetti squashes that we got in the garden. And then some pine cones we found outside with a little bit of cedar. And some more pine cones over here. And then, if you can see, this is what we made yesterday. My daughter designed it and I glued it together. That was our craft project yesterday. I just think it's beautiful. And then, if we have a look over here, this is our dinner. It doesn't. It is just uh, mushrooms with. Uh, beef that I had chopped up. Uh, it was a uh, roast, but I chopped it up, so I got about five or six meals out of that. And then I chopped up the last of my apples. So I'm going to use this in making a turnover, and of course I'm going to do something with my scraps. And I'm making some more uh, juice, apple juice, and we're having rice and beets for dinner. So, yeah, it's going to be really yummy. It smells really good. 
Oh, my hair is all messy now. Um, so yeah, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. And so far, so good on the no spend challenge. And I will see you all tomorrow. Have a wonderful night. Bye.